about two glasses of dash are required to produce each page of a book answer water dash we get from taps is also drawn from a lake or a river or a well it is then supplied through a network of pipes answer water the earth is covered with dash water most of this water is in oceans and seas answer two third The water in the oceans and seas has many salts dissolved in it. The water is dash, so it is not fit for drinking and other domestic, agricultural and industrial needs. Answer saline. Water, water everywhere, where is an or any drop to drink? Famous lines of the poem Rhyme of the Ancient Mariner written by S. T. Coleridge in 1978. Here the poet has described the flight of Dash on a ship lost in the ocean. Answer sailors. Dash play an important role in supplying the water that we use. Answer oceans. on heating dash changes into its vapor answer water the dash does not carry away the salt with it answer water vapors dash so formed become a part of the air and cannot be usually seen answer water vapors we also found that heating is essential to convert water into its dash answer vapor We have seen that water changes into its dash also from the fields, roads, rooftops and other land area. Answer vapor. During the daytime dash falls on the water in oceans, rivers, lakes and ponds. The fields and other land areas also receive sunlight. Answer sunlight. as a result water from all these places continuously changes into dash however the salts dissolved in the water are left behind answer vapor dash evaporates in shade also it could have taken more time because during the daytime all the air surrounding us gets heated the warm air provides heat for evaporation of water in the shade answer water dash takes place from a open surface of water as a result water vapor gets continuously added to air answer evaporation during dash water is lost by wheat plants that give us 1 kg of wheat is nearly 500 liters that is roughly 25 large sized buckets full of water answer transpiration The process of dash plays an important role in bringing water back to the surface of earth answer condensation As we go higher from the surface of the earth it gets cooler when the air moves up it gets cooler and cooler at sufficient heights the air becomes so cool that the water vapor present in it condenses to form tiny drops of water called dash answer droplets these tiny droplets that remain floating in air and appear to us as dash answer clouds it so happens that many droplets of water come together to form large drops of water some drops of water become so heavy that they begin to fall these falling water drops are what we call dash answer rain 
इन स्पेशल कंडीशंस इट मे आल्सो फॉल एज डैश और डैश आंसर हेल और स्नो वॉटर इन द फॉर्म ऑफ वेपर गोस इन टू एयर बाई डैश एंड डैश फॉर्म्स क्लाउड्स एंड देन कम्स बैक टू द ग्राउंड एज रेन हेल और स्नो आंसर एवोपरेशन एंड ट्रांसप्रेशन ऑलमोस्ट ऑल लैंड सर्फेसेस आर एबो द लेवल ऑफ डैश मोस्ट ऑफ द वॉटर दैट फॉल्स ऑन द लैंड एज रेन एंड स्नो सूनर और लेटर गोस बैक टू द ओशंस आंसर ओशंस डैश इन द माउंटेन्स मेल्ट इन टू वॉटर दिस वॉटर फ्लोस डाउन द माउंटेन्स इन द फॉर्म ऑफ स्ट्रीम्स एंड रिवर्स आंसर स्नो सम ऑफ द वॉटर दैट फॉल्स ऑन लैंड एज रेन ऑल्सो फ्लोस इन द फॉर्म ऑफ डैश एंड डैश आंसर रिवर्स एंड स्ट्रीम्स Most of the rivers cover long distances on land and ultimately fall into the sea or an ocean. However, water of some rivers flows into dash. Answer: Lakes. The rainwater also fills up the dash and dash. A part of the rainwater gets absorbed by the ground and seems to disappear in the soil. Answer: Lakes and ponds. Some of this water is brought back to the air by the process of dash and dash. The rest keeps in the ground. Answer: Evaporation and transpiration. Most of this water becomes available to us as dash. Answer: Ground water. dash are fed by ground water answer open wells thank you please like share and subscribe